Our ability to cope with stress is like a bridge in traffic. Like the vehicles on the bridge, stress can take all shapes and sizes, but it all goes to the same place. Ever had one of those days where you snap at something simple? Here's why. Like the bridge, we can only take a certain amount of weight. So let's say we have a big stress, like moving house or losing your job. That's like a huge truck rolling onto our bridge. It's big, but alone the bridge can handle it. Then let's say you bang your leg on the corner of a table. This could be a medium stress, like this car here. A few of these pile up throughout the day, and the bridge is getting pretty full. Then, at the end of the day, you have a small stress, like maybe your kid's not going to bed on time. Now normally, this would be like this little bike here, but combined with everything else, it's just too much for the bridge to take, and the whole thing comes crumbling down. So how do we stop this from happening? Well, there are two things we can do. We can let some of the traffic off, or we can take some of the weight out of what is there. You've probably seen two people who handle the same situation completely differently. The outside stress is the same, but the person's attitude towards it is different. Some of us carry the stress around and build it up. That's like taking this bus and then filling it with a horde of screaming school kids. More weight on the bridge. Other people accept the stress for what it is and decide to let go. The stress itself doesn't disappear, but the weight of it is reduced, like taking this fire truck and emptying out the water tank. Then there is letting traffic off the other end. Doing things that relieve stress, meditation, light exercise, getting a good night's sleep or eating a nutritious meal. All of these things let some of the traffic off, reducing the load on the bridge and keeping you away from that breaking point.